What is up, y'all? I have been wanting to put out a snakehead video for a really long time. And for those of you who have been subscribers, you know the Delco snakehead has eluded me for well over a year. Well, this is finally the video. And with this video, I want to do something a little different. I wanted to show y'all the whole story. So my obsession with this fish started over a year ago when me and my buddy John were fishing and this happened. What'd you get? What'd you say? Oh yeah, it's a good one. John, that's a snakehead. That is? Yeah, John, what the heck? I've always wanted to catch one of those. Are you are you kidding me? John! Can you, they got teeth? Yeah, sharp, super sharp. Yeah. John, that's a big catch. Dope. Dude, what the heck? <laughs> and after that happened, I became obsessed. I spent a week to two weeks hitting the Delco swamps so hard, and we came close. Yo, that's a snakehead. Yo, that's a snakehead. It happened. Oh my gosh, it happened. I was just about to leave. I just tried this spot. Just like, what the heck? I was like, just what? This is on my ultralight too. No! At this point, I pretty much gave up hope. And then all of a sudden, me and Pablo were fishing and this happened. What happened? Snakehead? Yes. Dude! Yeah. You finally did it! <laughs> nice? Holy <laughs> On the frog! <laughs> Yo, my heart's beating. My heart is you want me to try to grab him with these? Perfectly oh hooked. My God. What a day. Holy f dude. You are shaking, my friend. I uh, dude, I am so excited. By this point, I went on a snakehead spending spree and I bought all the type of snakehead tackle I could. I even upgraded my rods and we came close about a zillion times. I kid you not, a zillion. It was a couple months of just this happening. Oh, he missed it. Whenever I see them, they like just don't bite. Baby bit. Oh, we missed it. Pablo? Pablo? It happened. I missed it. It, it bit and didn't get hooked. It has been over a year trying to catch this fish, but finally, finally, I had this day. Enjoy. Good morning, y'all. We got an early one out here at Delco, Nashville Line. An early one out here, John Hines. Beat the sun up today. We are on our quest for the elusive snakehead. Why is this video any different than any others? I don't know. Probably might, might just be another video of me trying to catch it and me coming up empty-handed as I have for over 400 days now. Not even exaggeration. It's crazy, but today, I don't know. The elements aren't even working for me. Uh, I, here's a story, I came out because the weather's been crap, and this is the first day it's been decent. So I just need to go fishing, and I'm gonna try to catch the snakehead. And I'm probably gonna end up empty-handed and sad. Enjoy. I mean, we're seeing them. I cannot get them to bite for the life of me. So I'm trying a different spinner, different color combination, different blade. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. 
Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Holy s. Holy s. How the frick am I gonna get this guy up here? Oh my god. Oh my god. Yeah! Yeah! Oh my god. I did it. I did it. Oh my god. Dude, I love this spinner. I love this spinner. Oh, that is a snake head. I did it. I'm shaking. Oh my god. 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 I gotta go down there and get him. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> How many days has it been? Oh my god. I did it. Gotta go into the trash though. trash are you kidding me I had some time to process everything that happened. Took a couple days here, took a trip up to the mountains, and I've rewatched the footage. And after watching the footage, I do feel like I caught that snakehead. But I do want to close this chapter out, and I feel like I got to get a picture with it. I'm realizing like that is what bothered me last time was that I didn't get a picture with it. Like, isn't that a weird thing for for fishermen? Some of y'all probably know what I'm talking about, and some of y'all probably like, nah, I'd be fine. I don't need a picture, but. I guess that says something about me. I kind of think I do. So we are going to catch the Delco snakehead. If it doesn't happen today, it will happen eventually. And that will close out this video in this chapter. There's the snake. Oh, she's a little bite. Get up here. Get up here. Yes. 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 Oh my God. We did it. He's even bigger than the last one. Oh my God. He's beautiful. Oh. Oh my God. We do not want a repeat of last time. Woo! Oh my gosh, finally. All right, y'all, not too much left to do. I do want to get a weight on this thing. And it says 2.5, so I've got to weigh this and subtract it, and I'll let y'all know how much it weighs. All right, ladies and gentlemen, fish is unhooked. And I wanted to, I've been periodically running it back to the water and giving it some water. Um, they can stay out of the water for a really long time, but still just want to be conscientious that it still is a fish. And I've been chasing this forever. And I, I gotta say, you know, this is gonna be the end of the video, the end of the journey of my first snakehead. Everything seems complete to me now, you know? I think I caught my first one two days ago or three days ago, whatever it was. 
but there's no asterisk on this catch. I am holding, I'm touching the northern snakehead, the John Hines northern snakehead, the Delco snakehead that has eluded me for far too long. The exact date, our days, I'll put up somewhere over here. And people, I'm so happy. I have been trying to get this fish forever. And here it is. Oh, what do we have? Feels good. It's gotta be another snakehead. Don't spit. Oh my God. That's a monster snake head. Huh. Oh my God. Help. Help. Hey guys, by chance you have a net? What? Do you have a net by chance? No. Do you mind if I borrow that net? <laughs> no. Okay. Big. No. I got a big one. Oh, okay. Yeah, do you mind netting it for me? Does that mean snakehead? Yeah, this is good. Yeah, that's a big one. It's the biggest one I've ever caught. Just be. Uh, do you want? It's it's muddy. I don't want to get. You're gonna get your shoes dirty. Are you cool with that? Oh oh oh. Just careful behind. Yep. Oh, you're awesome, man. Thank you. What? You're the man, dude. Thank y'all. Nice, <laughs> what do you think, boys? Yeah. <laughs> Yo, thank you, man. No problem, man. Okay. You guys are the man. Come on, right. Six point nine ounces. I gotta subtract this out and let y'all know how much that is, but look, that's 6.9. All right, y'all, well, it's time we say goodbye to our huge dragon of a friend. That is a monster. That is awesome. He even swallowed that huge spinner. We were able to get it back, but oh my gosh. While our story ends here, our journey is just beginning. And I did want to release this video a bit different than any other one because I wanted to show you why I had such a crazy reaction, why this fish meant so much to me and, and catching it meant so much to me. It was a test in my persistence to get this fish and it took forever. So like I said, the story ends here, but our journey is just starting. It's a great fish and I'm sure there'll be more snakehead episodes to come in the future. Thank you all for watching. Have a good one.